Hello, welcome to this short Modelica process demo. In this demo, you will see how to generate a Modelica model from a CATIA CAD model and how to drive it using different Modelica models. The blue car door mechanism is used to showcase the process. The door opening mechanism contains a list of engineering connections included in the mechanism. Now let's play with the mechanism. As you can see, two commands are used to control the door operation. Please keep in mind the angle values. The same angle values are used in dynamic simulation. Now move to the logical architecture. At first, you need to find different torque values required to drive the revolute joints of the door mechanism. To do so, you can create a modelic representation of the door mechanism. To do this, there is a one-click command available known as Generate from Kinematics. When you go inside the model, you can see different Modelica classes such as different engineering connections, world reference, etc. Please note that the mechanical parts such as the door comes with its physical properties such as weight, inertia, etc. These Modelica classes are imported from a standard Modelica library as well as a CATIA multibody library. To find the exact torque value required to drive the door mechanism, you can apply torque to the revolute joints. Feedback loop with PID controller is used to generate torque. Now you can simulate the model. In this simulation, angle and torque values are plotted. In the second scenario, you can drive this mechanism using a DC motor. Same door, the logical block is reinstantiated. The controller is instantiated from the automatic door library under the components package. The controller is designed to use state logic. The controller changes its state depending on the feedback angle values coming from the DC motors. The power supply is instantiated from the same automatic door library. The DC motor model is available in the automatic door library under the components package. As you're driving two different revolute joints, you need two motors. It's possible to parameterize the motor model. Input values are applied from the integer table. It's possible to plot all these values as shown. Now, simulate the automatic scenario, plot angle, and torque values. In interactive scenario, controlled electrical door logical block is reinstantiated from the previous scenario. The remote key logical block makes use of the user interaction library. The toggle button is used to apply input. Now again, simulate the model. Click on the lock and unlock buttons to drive the door mechanism. Again, plot angle and torque values. Thanks for watching.